For this project, I am at my dad's house. So, different place, different scenery, different project. He has two rocking chairs that are outside on his front porch that have seen a lot of love and seen a lot of weather. So, this is what we've gotten used to it looking like but we took the pillows off that sat there for a while. And this is what it used to look like. There are apparently a lot of ways to restore outside furniture. And it was more than I thought. And when I started researching, I don't know about you, but there's a certain point where I just can't research anymore or my mind will explode. So when I get to that point, I just make a decision. You just kind of have to choose what you want to try and go for it. I'm so self-conscious about this right now. I'm in my dad's neighborhood doing this outside and people are driving by and I've never had anybody watch me before. Gosh, I don't like this. Okay. Um, these chairs need some work. I'm going to clean them and sand them, which I hope will be fast, but I know it won't be. First, I'm just wiping that off a little because there's little cobwebs and stuff all in it. Gross. Gross, gross. It is time to start sanding. I have an electric sander. I've been told I'm not going to annoy people if I do this. So, got my ear protection mask, all that good stuff. So, let's start seeing. Some parts are coming off better than others. Some parts are damaged a little bit more than others. This is gonna take some time. Plus, I'm wearing a mask, but it's cold out and my nose is running all at the same time. So it's, it's a pretty picture. Quick update. I hate this. I've been sanding for two hours and my body is dying. But it's getting there and it's feeling good. I'm using 120 sandpaper and I thought I'd have to go back with 220 to make it extra smooth, which if you want to be extra, go for it. But I think it feels nice. Um, especially to what it did feel like. And since it's going to be a thicker stain too, that's going to cover a little bit of it and make it even smoother. So, 120 it is. I like doing projects inside where people don't see me. thinking at the end of this video I might just be showing you one chair, but I will get the other one done. Um, it will get done, and it will look a lot nicer, and it will look a ni- it will look a lot nicer. But anyway, yay, 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 let's do this.
I will stand as well as I physically and mentally can, do as much as I can tonight, and then cross my fingers that the semi-transparent stain will hide the rest. Because this is taxing, and it's not a project I want to do again. Sadly, there's that chair back there, and I have to do it again with that one. All right, another day, another thing to do besides sanding. I have to wipe off the chair, I'm gonna do it with like a damp paper towel to get all the excess sawdust off of it. Um, and then I'm gonna stain it. And I'll stain underneath first, let that dry a little bit, flip it over, stain the rest. All right, I've got my Valspar One Coat Exterior Stain and Sealer Semi-Transparent. I've got a screwdriver to try to open it with because I forgot to bring over a paint can opener. So let's see if this works. Very easily. So if you can't find a paint can opener, just use this. I also feel like this is not a very hard can to open. So stir this up and just start painting. like so far since the bottom is not as well done as the top but I'm gonna keep going and then either show you the final product or show you that I had to do something else quite possible so see you soon all right I thought I was done but I'm not I did one coat I'm gonna do a second coat just on the stuff that's really easy to see because it looks streaky. So I'm going to fix that. Here's my advice. If you're wanting to redo rocking chairs or any chairs such as these and you're wondering should I stain it or should I paint it and they're pretty even just paint it paint it paint it <laughs> sanding this and sanding it well enough that you can stain it it took three days of sanding after I got done with work until it got dark it was all great. It was great. It's not the color that either of us thought it would be. Thankfully, I have a nice dad who's just like, as long as it's well painted and well protected, I like it. So maybe in the future, I'll make it a little bit more exciting. If you're wondering what it's going to be like to do different types of projects, I'll show you because if I tried to edit it to look perfect my videos would be very short because my projects don't go perfectly and I'm just learning as I go so um, follow along if you would like and it is cold out here there's a lot of road noise so I'm sorry if you've been listening to that I don't know what editing this is gonna be like I like inside better mmm I'm gonna go eat dinner I wonder if this road noise is going to be picked up. Probably. I look really white. I am really white. But am I that white? Probably. Um...